The V8 Supercars headed to Simmons Plains Raceway in Tasmania for the second event on the 2013 calendar. This is 60-60, off and running. Championship leader Craig Lowndes was left seething after contact with Shane Van Gisbergen sent him to pit lane. Big championship implications. The halftime break saw a flurry of action as the teams got ready for the second 60km sprint to the chicken flag. flag. Let's get rolling for the second half of this race. Fabian Coulthard took the lead after a bold move on four-time champion Jamie Winker and went on to win his maiden V8 Supercar Championship race. Fabian Coulthard wins the 60-60 race at Simmons Plains. On Sunday, Jason Bright started race four alongside teammate Coulthard. The instructions are clear, do your best, but do not make contact with each other. David Reynolds had a unique view of the track. And Reynolds up on the wall. But it was Bright who led from start to finish. He's blitzed him and two out of two for Brad Jones Racing this weekend. In race five, Scott Pye was lucky to walk away uninjured after brake failure saw him hit the wall at over 160 kilometres an hour. Fabian Coulthard passed race leader Mark Winterbottom and went on to claim his second win of the weekend, giving Brad Jones Racing a clean sweep in Tasmania. Look out, New Zealand. Here comes Fabian Coulthard. Jamie Wincup leads the championship ahead of Ford Performance Racing's Will Davison and James Courtney from the Holden Racing Team. This weekend sees the V8 Supercars return to Pukekohe Park Raceway in Auckland after a five-year hiatus. The track has recently undergone a $6 million upgrade and has a long history in V8 Supercar racing. Yeah! Kiwis Fabian Coulthard, Shane Van Gisbergen and Scott McLaughlin will lead the charge in front of the home crowd. Catch all the action from the ITM 400 Auckland this weekend on 7.